Video Friday with Art Resin. Hey guys. Hi. Hi. So you know sometimes um, you get a little imperfection or bubble or hair in your piece and you have to sand down and pour a fresh coat. So today I'm going to walk you through every step of sanding. Okay, so first thing you want to do is grab some 80 grit sandpaper. You need a coarse sandpaper and the reason for this is you want to rough up your surface to create some tooth for your fresh resin layer to adhere to. Okay, so 80 grit sandpaper. So sand down the whole thing. I know it looks scary. I know it looks like you're destroying your artwork, but believe me, it's gonna look perfect again. So make sure when you're sanding that you sand down far enough to remove whatever the imperfection is, the bubble or the hair. So here it is after sanding, and I know it looks completely destroyed, but trust me, when you pour your fresh resin layer on, it is gonna look beautiful again. Okay, so we can't pour on it like this, obviously. We've gotta clean off all of the sanding residue. So what you wanna do is grab yourself a wet paper towel, Okay, it doesn't have to be soaking wet, just moist. And wipe off all of that residue, all that sanding residue. You wanna make sure you get rid of all this dust because you don't want it flying into your fresh wet resin, right? And you can use a couple of paper towels. You can do this process a couple of times if you want to. Because it's still moist right now, you don't wanna pour your resin on with any moisture here, otherwise you're gonna get cloudy resin. So once you've wiped it down with a wet paper towel, just set it aside and let it dry for a few minutes, okay? So I've sanded my piece here. Okay, so I'm gonna take one more precaution because if you actually feel the surface of this, even though I wiped it with a paper towel, there's still a little bit of residue on here and we wanna have a perfect pour. We don't wanna create more problems. So what I'm gonna do, well, you can do a couple of things. You can use a brush and just wipe it off and make sure all that residue is gone. Or you can grab a can of this dust off, which is super handy to have, especially if you're doing something like a wood tray um, that has little nooks and crannies. These are indispensable. So just give it a shot here. Okay. Right. That feels way better now. So now we're ready for our resin pour. So I've got my art resin here mixed together for three minutes. I scraped the bottoms and the sides. My piece is propped up. Okay. And I'm going to pour and you're gonna see the magic. Okay, so just gonna spread it along the edges here. Okay, so remember how scuffed up it was? Watch this. There we go, all those bubbles are disappearing. You can't see any of those scratch marks. When this cures, it is gonna look perfect. You'll never ever know those bubbles were there. Okay guys, that's your tip. Video Friday with that resin. Thank God that's over. <laughs>